It has been proposed that Homo erectus evolved from Homo habilis about 2 million years ago. Homo erectus was the first human to hunt. Before that, hominin scavenged meat, often fighting off vultures or packs of wild dogs for Meat is what made our human ancestors' brains grow. From the trees, to the ground, and from four legs to two. Homo erectus took a stand for humanity's future, and became the first human ancestor to hunt. Homo erectus featured a flat face compared to earlier hominins, pronounced brown ridge, and a low, flat skull. Homo erectus was the first human species to have featured a projecting nose, which is generally thought to have evolved in response to breathing dry air in order to retain moisture. This also allowed for distinguishing the direction different smells come from, to facilitate navigation and long-distance migration. This part of their evolution would be key in its 2 million year long journey, for conquering the planet. Homo erectus almost took over the world, during its nearly 2.5 million year lifespan. He conquered much of the planet, and had to have air mingled with his hominin presence. All of a sudden, the homo stood up for good. His femur bone was long, hard and fixed in a position so that he would stay erect. No more of this front-to-back legs teeter tottering. Homo had made a decision and that was to be permanently erect. He was homo because he was in fact a hominem. His would create tools to hunt and kill prey for food, as he expanded the human territory, nearly conquering the planet we now live on. Homo erectus rose to the top of the food chain, making us not sitting ducks for animal predators on four legs. Homo erectus stood tall and mighty. On two legs and erect. <laughs>